That was strange. Truck the down the one. road you could use, I guess, Pops. I don't know what state it's in. 21% fuel, 600 yeah, power. Needs fuel. So if you wait there, Paul, if I jump in the fuel truck that's there and drive that down with you. I'm just trying to get back in the game. Just be careful, that thing falls over easy. Yep, I've had to kill Epic. Can you go the high side with that? I can, yeah. I don't think that muddy path is good. That's so me, Paul, that's not me at the moment. Oh. I had to kill Epic for it to allow me back in the game. Um, right. Do you, are you, you're not stuck, are you, Paul? No, no, I was trying to drag Pups out of that mud. And then he vanished. I do think that's the first time I've, with the game's ever kicked us for changing maps. There is some weird stuff going on in this game today. Yep. Uh, I just got kicked Rome again. Left the game. Just got kicked again. <laughs> While trying to join. Auto kick. Restart, restart Epic then. There is some weird stuff happening. Oh, Agent Puppy, I summon thee in this game. I wonder if it's better on Steam. <laughs> Lol. Like the MP stuff. You logging back in, Pops? Uh, it lo said it loaded the game, and now I just got a screen with snow and a radar turning. Okay then. After I tried to join your game. It never I don't remember it seeing no, you're not in my game yet. No, it said it loaded your game, but hasn't actually put me in your game. What is going on? And all the struggle getting through that map was all for nothing. Been doing some weird stuff all day for him, I don't worry about. Mine is searching. It says Rome's in the game. They noticed something different. It says Rome left the game. I have a feeling Paul's gonna have to restart. Uh, but I, I was talking about my name in the game, but you know. For each of them. Yeah, I saw that. So yeah, the, the game won't let us in anymore, it seems. The trouble is, Sommy's in his own vehicle, I think. So if I restart, he'll yeah. lose his positioning. Yeah. Yeah. So we'll have to wait until he's done that. That yeah. will take a while, he's got like three different points to scan. I've only got one because I've done the two already. Oh, nice one. Fair enough. The issue is, is it's a bit of a... It could take me five minutes, it could take me 20 minutes. Yeah. Can we have oh, well. five? <laughs> well, I, I can give you five. Pups <laughs> looks like he's now in. Yeah, I've restarted Epic about 12 times. Pups is not in my game. <laughs> it says, oh, Puppy's left the game. Yeah, so we can't join. Yeah. But it does come up on my screen as though you are, so it's like... Uh, well, while we wait for that, I'm gonna go for a bio break. Be right back. No worries. That is annoying. Yup. Well, let me put it like this, Paul. You make the decision. I've got to travel, I think, to where we picked that rocket carrier trailer up.
Yeah, I can't invite you or anything. It's not like Steam. Well, I don't know, Sammy. It, it doesn't affect me if I restart the game. It affects you. So it depends how much kind of effort you've got to put back into it. How about Better bounce epic as well. Oh, I want you to be safe. Just doing a cloud sync. We start in game. It seems it's not that better on Steam either. Because hmm. it uses its own thing, doesn't it? It's got nothing to do with the launchers. Yeah. Like, in theory, it's exactly the same game. I have returned. How about? Right, can you join now? No, I'm just relaunching the game, so I'll let you know in a second. Sam. No, it's not time to end the stream today. <laughs> I didn't see you coming this time, Ty, otherwise I'd end the stream. <laughs> Speaking of which, it's time to end the stream. <laughs> I'll be, I'll be. All right. Nice. Well, somebody's in the game. What about Pups and Brown? It is I'm... searching. It's searching again. What if I... If I kill oh. my epic? It's found it. No, I think I've got the same that Sean has, just uh, the dish turning around and nothing happening. Oh, oh, something's happening. I'm in. Yep. Can you stay in though? That's the question. That is a very good question. So she left the garage, so you're in. No, yeah, he's just falling in the lever pole. Are you able to join pubs? Uh, trying to find out. Now to restart Epic again. There's a lot of photons in here. In this here garage parking lot. Hilo, don't give him tips. And puppy join the okay. game. I'll jump in. The fuel truck still needs moving, doesn't it? Yep. Or, as it... I've moved that as well. That's just down okay. the road now. That was so strange. Yup.
I was relying on you telling me, pups. Film 93, okay. thank you for 82 months. Hope you're well, sir. And there's your truck. Let's see if I can repair it with anything. It doesn't need repairing. No, I think it just needs fuel, doesn't it? Right, splash and dash then. May as well top me up while you're here. Indeed. Check on the other side of the bridge, pups. Okay. There's more space over there. Not much left in it. I think like 400 litres or something. Mm. Could be even less. Well, we'll see how we get on. Uh, Firex has the longest sub, I think. Why is there a shady road going to the right there, I wonder? Because that's where you meant to go. Yeah. It's my waypoint was... Um... Slightly off. Yep. So I got to the waypoint and it went, and you should have gone right. <laughs> Hindsight waypoints, that's what I've got. String delay, Paul, that's what it is. Yeah. Brain delay. <laughs> and someone is setting fireworks off. Again. What? What are they celebrating? I don't know, Paul. It's happened like three times a week lately. They must like Maybe Saturdays. They're... Maybe they're Yeah, celebrating. it's Saturday again. <laughs> yeah, we have got fireworks still. Let's set them off. The timing is real, though. A firework goes off and then a police siren. I sure it wasn't the car alarm. Nah, it's probably so. Um, what must I on? Oh, hang on, I'm stuck on a rock. Noob. This tiny rock to my left here, Paul, that I'm running over now. James 789. Halloween Bake Off, oh god. <laughs> it's August, mate. Calm down. So he's definitely all doing takeaway now. I'm back. What are you talking about? 
He's just eating it. No, I'm not. <laughs> if you like, I'll send you screenshots of my food hub and my just eat and my local takeaway. And... <laughs> it can be Photoshop. That doesn't prove a thing. Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm going to go through that much effort. I you could have made them before you ordered. I might, um... No, I'm going out after the stream and I might have a, a takeaway more now, but no plans currently. Going out on the lash? Not quite. <laughs> Sorry, Paul, this tiny tree stopped it. It's the rock that you beached on, I think. I believe so. I'm just wondering how we're going to get the trailer back, though. Like, what's the return journey? Because if it's this way, we're doomed. Figure that out as we go along. So we got the yeah. Now you got to get it back. <laughs> uh, hang on, which way was it? It's left here somewhere, isn't it? Yeah, I believe so. You only want waypoints. Wait, we got to go through this. My truck gonna fit? Exactly. No, truck? this isn't right. This isn't right. Where's the waypoint? No, the waypoint is dead ahead. This kind of isn't on the map, really. It kind of is, but isn't. This is the road that you said we should take. The one that loops around the uh, the dome. Can you fit through that? Yeah. Let me turn my lights off so I'm not blinding you. Uh, there's an invisible wall. Oh no, it's a signpost which you can drive through, but I can't. Wait, what? Ouch. What signpost? There's a signpost in the middle of them. There's no signpost. <laughs> there is. What? The signpost is on my front right, front left bumper. Uh, on my screen, it's on your front right. Uh, back right, I should say. <laughs> can you quite do that? Can we, like, brute, oh, hang brute on. force So you attach it to me, me, I can now move the pole. There you go. It's magic, mate. What is going on with this game today? <laughs> it's the magic of a squirrel winch. <laughs> yeah, we've got to come back this way with a giant trailer. Which is 100% not going to go between those anti-landing things. Oh, God. I'm good. I'm fine. Oh, hi, Tommy. Hey. I might need some assistance getting up there. <laughs> Are you falling over, bro? Nah. I just couldn't get through there. <laughs> because I don't have massive wheels on my truck. It's a Marks and Spencer winch, Ken. That's the wrong truck. Yeah, oh we're not God. getting the trade at this nah. waypoint. And I don't think it'll go any other way either. Because the other way means crossing that river thing, which has ice that just... Yeah. It's going to be fun. Why can't it just, when I'm trying to winch something, why can't it just prefer the thing that I'm looking at? Because it has to attach to everything camps first. Like I'm looking directly at your truck and I press the winch button and it winches onto a tree to the right yeah. of me. Like, what? what's the logic? This is just getting worse. Yep. I've been up here once, mate, and it was n a nightmare. Hang on. 
I'm on the rocks of non-steeringness. Yeah, there aren't any tracked vehicles. I'm surprised they don't release them as a DLC. How much further? Should be down the road now, I think. You think non-chain tyres is bad in, a, in the ice? Wait until you put tracks on it. Can we get rubber tracks? <laughs> nah, it's not. Plastic? Well, tracks enables you to have low ground pressure, doesn't it? Well, rubber tracks so, exist. Well, that's good to It's just the concept that you're not putting enough weight down to take advantage of the traction that you can produce with tracks. But it's one of the most thrilling things I've ever done, which is doing donuts on a runway in a track vehicle. It's not just the ground pressure though, is it? Because like when the track goes down, it sits in the ground. And unlike a wheel, it can't spin. So you've got something to push back. Like the wheel can push back on the track without it spinning. On soft ground anyway. What the heck is this? Oh no. I haven't been to this bit, but... Okay. I have no idea what... I'll let you go first. Okay. You got a snorkel. <laughs> Oof, that hurts. Yikes, that hurts. There's a big slab as you come out. And it punched a hole in my suspension. Let me see if I can find him. If I can... Sneak up this way. That's the destination up there. Oh, God, don't do that. It's all good. I reckon you could have, got, could have gone through that way. Oh, you two have moved the fuel truck, haven't you? Yep. Right. I think I might have to go there. I've got a load of fuel on me, if you needed some. Even though I've got loads of ground clearance, I'm stuck. Well, the words were screwed come to mind. Yeah. That's asymmetric as well. That's going to tip over one way a lot easier. Some air. Yeah. Prime's falling over. Maybe. That's a yes. <laughs> Why would you go that way? Because that's where I need to pick something up. Right, pups. Yes. We're going to go on an adventure, mate. Okay. Down this road. Right. Yep. And then we're gonna I'll hug. You. We're gonna turn south. There's a gap in the fence there. You can yep. see. Then we're gonna go out on the precarious ice. Yeah. And then I don't have a plan. <laughs> because I can see a giant boulder in the way. 
I think maybe we've got a hop scotching over that ice, maybe. Yeah, I reckon we could go over, you know that ice where your waypoint is? I reckon we could go across there. It's either that I, bit or the other bit. I will wish you both the best of luck. Well, you're the one coming down the hill to rescue us, right? No, I'm not. I'm going to go and do my scan like I meant to have done but three times over by now. We just go to now. where your last waypoint is, then we'll take it from there. Sound like a plan? That, uh, do you not remember when we first came here, Paul? Mm -hmm. And you were in your tower and, and it completely and utterly just went hull deep into nothing. Yep. And that's remember. where you're taking and you're heading down there again. That's why I didn't want to come this way. But frankly, the way that we just came is definitely a non-starter. Is there any uh, way we can get... Okay, from you... Okay. Yeah. Right, I was coming for you, but never mind. Ah. Okay. Whoops. Too late now. Yeah. Communication. That's the key. We got this. Go nice and safe. And them in their own garage. Always useful. The plan is amazing, right up until the point where we get to the ice. Uh, Jones, have a good night. Oh, there's a lot of rocks here. Yay. You got this, pups. Tatarin doesn't like big boulders. It's like watching a beetle. <laughs> Just take your time through there, no need to smash it. Alright, let's see if we can get back there. The legs still up on your trailer pups. Yeah. It's just bizarre. It's just extremely low to the ground. Mm. What's it showing on your screen? The legs is like sticking down as if they're going to catch on everything. I could. Well, that might disattach and reattach. No, don't worry about it. It doesn't matter as long as it's working for you. Legs are going to catch on this. That is not fun. That's the gap he was talking about. Yep. I'm going to have to take a wide swing at this. Yeah, I'm just worried about the leg catching on that. But the further round you can go, the better. Is that the leg catching? Yeah. Oh, is that a clearing just slightly further up? Take a run up. Can 
clear in one. That's the meters. ice in front of us. To the right, I don't think the fence breaks after this. There's like too many trees in the way though. Yeah. If you try and go over that ridge, I think it'll beach. And then you've got all that ice down there. Let's see if I can straighten this trade off. Oh my god, that's so annoying. Right, Paul, yep. if you go back through and pull the trader to the right, the back of the trader to the right, we may be able to squeeze one leg past and then put it back to the left to get the other one up. Unless I can find right. which point that's strong enough. So which way does it need to go first? Towards you, the way you just came. So if you just pull the back of the trailer, reverse. Wonder if we can get it around enough to get the leg off the... without it flipping that. like a couple of inches left to go and it should be free. What about if you pull where it attaches to my truck pull, like this corner? I can try. Tip it. We can tip it slightly, just enough to lift the foot over the thing. What is... You want me to tip this side of it or the other yeah, side of tip, it? Yeah, tip the side you're on. Because it's, it it's just one leg that's catching. Try it. We're so close. What if I go around the other side and get underneath and yeah. basically wedge you up? I've got to turn my engine off. I'm on 123 litres. And we have a fuel my, issue. <laughs> yeah, and apparently my roof is empty. Yeah, I couldn't fill your roof. Like, you have to fill your own roof. Even though it's your truck? No, no. I mean, when I was in the real fueling truck, I can fill you, but not your roof. You have to transfer it to your roof. Have you got the fuel in that tank behind your cab, or is that gone? It's gone. There we go, there we go. Right. That's one half. 
Right, now I need to winch this part to the right and hook it back around. Watch you don't come back over and... Yeah, yeah. That's all the fuel we have. Can I come on the other side and winch? I'll winch, I think. The winch is stronger. I heard a trailer detached sound. Yeah, I just did it. Thank you for half a year, Fried Camel. Do you know what? Why don't you detach it and attach on a winch and see if you can pull it? Because when you attach it to your truck, it drops it down a lot. Yeah, that's a good idea. Maybe you can, like, winch and just yank it over. See how high it is? Yeah, yeah. Do you reckon you'll be better off getting in between the trees than me? I'll just try winching that and see what happens. Thank you, Kermit. It's not moving, it's, is it? It's like the legs uh, are just digging in. It's like a 90 degree pull on the thing. Oh no! Don't do that! Rip. Just go back round, boy. It should go back on its legs pretty easily. Actually, wonder if we... <laughs> Paul, leave it like that a minute. Go on, drag it over. If we drag it over? If it works. Get the legs over the other side. Yeah. Oh, no. Oh, okay, no. Paul, if you go in between yeah. the trees and pull it. I don't. If I go back around, yeah? I can act like a wedge for you to pull it over. If I get another angle on this, back in the trees. Uh, distinct rider, thank you for five months, and the extra suspension damage that I got whilst reading your message. The last the legs are over. Right. The wheels look like they're snapping off. <laughs> oh, the back on. No, 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 no. <laughs> what are you doing? I was trying to get through the tree in the trailer. I'm stuck. I don't think I can, uh, hang on. There we go. Go on, keep pulling, just keep pulling. Right, you must be able to drag it towards you now. I'm trying. I reckon if you... A bit more and then we can flip it back, I reckon. There, there you, go. you go. That should do it. You can flip that back now. Yeah. I'll do it. Hang on. Don't move. I am not moving. What the heck? 
a floating pier. No, it, I, it was going and then it just suddenly didn't. What? I'm trying again. That took a lot getting it over Yeah, there. we're going to have to sort the fuel out now. Which is a real issue on this map. Jeez, man, that just bust a wheel. Right, we need to A, get fuel, and B, work out some kind of a route through this. Careful so, down there. Paul, not that we'll ever do it ever again, but you know that alternative route that I said that there was, Second rather than the wants bent to try over the Australian poles. mode. Uh, I, I couldn't hear you last half. Say again? You, you know when we went underneath all those telegraph poles that were bent, and we said there's got to be a better route? Um, where well, is we this the in the world? Through. Right, okay, down there. Yeah. yeah, you know that route that we said that looks like a path? Yeah. It is. Good to know. <laughs> so it's like, it, it, other than like one rock obstacle yeah. in the way, it's pretty much just a clean sail and drive straight through scenario. Thank you, the bits for less here. Right, so Paul, I'm thinking straight across here. Well, like I say, when we tried this with a tattering, it was a bit of an interesting time. So let me go and dip my toe in the ice. Off you go. Actually, we didn't come this way. We went the other way. This is kind of like the crossing where the farm is. Uh, try the detach? Yeah. I've got to take it slow to try to keep the attention. That's why I'm just pulling you over quickly so it yeah. doesn't have time. Right. That's that one. Yeah. And now deep snow. I'll use my stop start technology on this chart. Please hold. <laughs> Play some elevator music. Oh my god. More bad I push you. Did that help? I don't know, until I get out of this snow. Uh, that's interesting. Can you push me any more? Right now, I can't move. <laughs> I'm just digging a hole. Let me try and swing the back around there. An upgrade? For what? There's just nothing. Scout engine. Noise. This is some horrendous terrain, pups. Yeah. It, it just doesn't look it, but it is. I can see. If I can nudge you on. Of grab. sorts. Right, let me grab the trader again. This terrain is just insane, man. Okay, so along this bit where I am is hard. Anything on the inside with those rocks is soft. So you kind of want to go as straight as you can, and then at the last minute turn, because your trailer's going to bog down. Let me grab the tree. 
Do you want me to come over to you guys with some fuel? Yes. If you can, yeah. We're like running on fumes. Let's see. I'm hoping pulling the trade will lift me up. Yeah, all that that episode was called the piano. It's a fantastic Lol and Hardy. I think we need something bigger than a tattering, what I've got. We need some muscle. A cat's not good. winch to me see if it helps. Every time I move I got we can train keeps disconnecting. No. Yeah. I can't drive too far. <laughs> Stop pulling <laughs> <laughs> I was hoping just like like wrench it through. Oh no. Now I can't get back onto the trailer. Oh god. Before Hang on, let me get that out of the way. <laughs> Any more forward. Hang on, I'm using stop start technology. <laughs> this ice is not precarious at all. What the? What's up? I don't know, he just suddenly flipped. You look like you're under it, but in the wrong place. Feel of you go. Sixty liters. <laughs> Can't you just pull that front over? That's what I keep trying, but it just keeps glitching back. And every time I get it on the ice, where we know we can get under it, it just doesn't want to go. Hopefully you don't want to end up in that river. So how does one get across that water? Yes. We haven't figured that bit out yet. That's a million dollar question. Well, I'm on the other side of the water. I know, I can see you. Well. 
So close, but still so far away. I may as well see if I can get over and grab fuel and then refuel pumps. Didn't like plan. There is some very precarious ice around here, bro, I seem to remember. Yeah. I'll just sit here. Right, can you refuel me? That bar. There you go. Hang on. Right, can you do it again? Hang on. Voila. I shall go rescue a, a stricken jeep now. Which yeah. is what I came here for. <laughs> I would stay there a minute because we're probably going to need we're more We're only going to need more fuel, bro. Okay. If you want to leave that or something. I'll just sit here and spectate, spectate then. Oh, I've got it to this point, Paul. No. <laughs> well done. <laughs> With 26 litres remaining. It's alright. Got some juice. That well, should be enough to get me across to Prome. Yeah, I've got 1500 litres. So. Oh, can you try and flip the trailer back on its wheels when you fill me up? And then I should be able to atta attach it again. Right, it's back on. Right, I need to turn around. <laughs> <laughs> I know, this is becoming a problem. <laughs> Alright, so the main culprit you're going to have is the legs on the big boulder bit. Yeah. So you kind of want to come this way. And then hang a right before this big boulder. It's annoying the way it does that. Yeah. And if you don't catch it in time, you drive too far off and then you can't get back under it. Where are we even taking this thing? Don't. I was going to say, don't come out of there without the trailer. You'll never get back <laughs> under it. Me up and then I'm gonna build yeah. my Same. I seem to have emptied my, my own fuel tank. Yeah, it's because you didn't choose the right source. Pops! Sorry! Alright, let me fill my tanks on top up. Can you fill me up again? Uh, and I got kicked from the game. The game Actually. just literally froze. Yeah. And then all three of you just went. Pfft. That'll be really interesting to see what happened to that because yeah. I was in a tattering at the time, going down a cliff. And I was refueling. It just totally well, froze for me. So the game's oh. zapped at your end. Yeah. Uh, you want I'll to just restart it? Can do. 
Oh, what's up, G? Just looking at the time. Well, you've got plenty of fuel in there, haven't you, pups? Yeah, I've got fuel now. So I we should be good to, to go. In. Can you get back in, or do I need to restart stuff? I'm checking now. I just restarted Epic. I'm glad we got the fuel off Rome before that. Found happened. a bug. Report it by email. <laughs> so that we can ignore it. Oh, or you'll get one of them automated responses. Your yep. bug report is very important to us. You'll be sure to follow it up. Oh, rip. You back in, Sammy? I'm back in. I, I didn't quit anything. I just rejoined. Paul, have a look at yeah, what I'm happened rejoined. to your tattering. <laughs> Down the side of a cliff. Yeah. On his what? side, wrecked. Wait, no fuel. Wrecked. Shooting, so no fuel. Hold in the fuel tank. Four yep. flat tires and no suspension. Wow. Well, that's wow. that one done. Well done. It's recovering then. I blame Frome for all of this. What's <laughs> <laughs> happening since Frome joined? Yeah. That's, that's, um... So you see that road that's sort of to your west? Yeah. That was where I was. Where were you going? I was, so I was trying to find the seismic point around there somewhere, and yeah, I just. Mm. That <clears throat> that road to the west is the one that me and Pops went down, and basically said, "Don't ever go down there." <coughs> yeah, but I, there's a seismic point over there somewhere. So I went all the way down the western, the eastern side into the town and I don't have to track back north, so... Yeah, that's um, a painful uh, crash. Ferric, thank you for three months. Aren't we ready, Paul? Yeah. Are you going to just recover that blue one, Paul, while I can start trying to drive that back? Uh, which garage you need it in the river? Just put it in the river, yeah. And I'm going to actually put it in the river. These have nothing to do with me. Oh, it's the uh, Sammy. Do you, need, do you need me to spawn a scanner or something? No. I mean, if you want to, well, if you want to get a truck with a seismic module on it, then I could be driving that, and that'll be in place for tomorrow, I suppose. And if it crashes again before then, at least you haven't lost any. Well, yeah. this is what I'm thinking. It's just painful. If it, we, we know the well, game's unstable in multiplayer. Well, it's four times that I've now done that same trip. Exactly. Uh, you just park up somewhere, Paul, and then going to spawn that thing for Sammy. I'll meet you at the top of this rocky part. Okay. So something in the river. Uh, I think basically you just need to either get one of your discs and put the seismic m modules on that
Okay, that's now the arms jumping out. You should be able to jump in now. What the? Cheers. Um, Whoa. <laughs> um. Well, that happened. Yeah, I think. I don't know. I was spawned in in close proximity to the pups, and it just went mad. What is your trailer doing in the tree, pups? It's not on my screen. <laughs> well, okay then. I think it's a restart the whole thing, which, yeah. <laughs> oh my god, this game. I'm getting the biggest feeling of Groundhog Day right now. Please don't, Sam. I don't think my my stress level is going to handle that. <laughs> Snowrunner is entertainment. For the people watching. <laughs> well, there's a reason we're all called raging. Pretty much. Try and get down the side there, Paul. I have no idea where we're going. Uh, okay. Don't know if you can fit down there. No, come down there. I have a feeling I've been down this road before. Shadow Wolf as soon as possible. I'm gonna fill up on this little trailer here, Paul. Generally speaking, the Russian vehicles are pretty good, pretty strong. Hey, I left that scout trailer there. I dragged it here. With my own hands, pups. Actually, I'm wondering, would a Tatarin be better to do the thing I'm doing? If you fill up as well, Paul, I fill both the jerry cans up on this as well. Filling you up. And what's left, I'll take, because I've got tanks on top. Okay. Yeah, we just emptied that. Yeah, those little scout trailers can be a lifesaver. Say that again, Paul. Please fit under this lap. Oh, come on, game. What's up? I, this I don't think we're going to get past this lamppost. The one that's leaning over. <laughs> the dead strike back. It's like, yeah, okay. And I can't get enough. I can't go up the hill because then we're half flip. <laughs> I reckon we turn it on its side and drag it up here. Yeah. So we turn it on its side so that the sticky out bits up. I don't I know how we do it, I... but. I will try and do it. Hang on. Come on, I'm like an inch and I can get under that. Oh. It's not the fact that this game has lampposts and, and telegraph poles that just are in the way. It's the fact that you can't do anything about them that annoys yeah. me. It's the fact you can't just get a welding torch and cut the darn thing out of the way. Yeah, and I wouldn't even mind if there was a digger that was the slowest thing in the world. Yeah, a that tool. That you had to drive from the other map. I don't care, I would do it. Yeah. I it's like still the concept that we would spend so much time doing terrain deformation in this game to make routes easier for ourselves that we would, wouldn't we? Yep. It should just give you options about how you want to tackle things. Just give you the tools to do it and then lots of problems. I'm not sure how we're going to turn that over. You might have to um, back it up, maybe, and we'll turn it over back there. The worst bit is, Paul, I can lift the tray, like tip the trailer so it will go underneath, but then. Well, let's try. It's a way for me to go forward. Let's try yeeting you through then. Is that going to work? Not yet. 
I can tip the trailer, but then my winch is in the way. But now, the trailer should go. Can you winch me and pull? Yeah, I'm gonna do it now. Go, 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 go! <laughs> there we go! The yeet worked, nice. Some extra horses. Alright, this is where you have to... I mean, you may be able to go through that muddy water. Normally I go this way. I, I just don't know which is better, pups. I'm just thinking with the trailer for that. They're Dude. both not easy. Yeah. This is a ridge which will beat you. That's mud. I'm in as low gear as I can on this for a second. Hey, and thank you for gifting us up to iPatch. Welcome. Right, let me grab onto you. There we go. some boulders to get past now. Okay. Can't see anything going wrong with this. I'll let you go through first. Well, yeah. Boulders are the Tatarin's nemesis. That's if you can get through. It's like kryptonite. <laughs> Good luck not getting the leg stuck on the rock. Like a glove. Wow. <laughs> like a glove. We might even make it to the river. about this. It's fine. That one was worse. Come on. We're going to eat it. Okay. Just don't go all the way down the slope. Keep halfway. So the legs passed. There you go. Nice. Sorry, whoever's in the way. The seismic Sammy. <laughs> hey, Sammy. I um. Oh. <laughs> no. He's broken again. Woo! Um. What? When we get within range of each other, crazy physics happens. Pups hasn't got a trailer. Yeah. Your your truck, Sammy, went flying up in the air and landed again. Oh yeah, I've now nearly completely ripped. Right, let me know when you're past Paul, because I'm not risking anything. For those of you that don't believe me, if you wish to check that link out, I can't see a trailer. I'm now clear. Okay, going through now. Um, pups. 
There's no trailer. Hate to say it. Sammy stole your screen. trailer. On my screen, there is a trailer. Let me move and then I'll reattach and see if it comes back. I 100% have a trailer on the back of my truck. I can hear you. Yeah, I don't know. I tell you what, I'm going to jump out of this vehicle. Over there somewhere and jump back. Okay. Just to see what. Because it was on your screen all the way there, right? Until we hit the tunnel. Until we hit Sommy. Because that happened earlier with Sommy. It, it did something. It's one of my trailers. I don't know. I can't explain it. Um, on my screen, the construction rig trailer is so far in the air, it's its own orbit. Yeah, this is what worries me. Because if you remember that, I was like, oh, it's fine for me. And somebody's like, no, it's not. And when I spawned back in, it just, it gone. I don't know what to do. I think we've lost that trailer. That's what I think has happened. But do I dare attempt to jump into another truck and then jump back? Or do I just keep it on the back and then just go to the destination? How far do we have to go? There you go. Check those two screenshots. I can't check them. <laughs> no. Right, where are we going? Hang on. It's not that far. So if you need fuel, I'm getting close to where you are. Which mission are we doing Top now? secret, Paul. Hmm. Meep, meep. Evacuation point is right down there. Rip trailer, it was a wonderful workhorse. Frame, please do not come close. Okay. I don't know how we get over the uh, the river pumps. I guess we've got to go across the bridge. Yeah, we have to go back that way and then up at Oenofa to the bridge. Frank, just keep your distance a minute because I don't know what's going on. I okay. don't know how we get back again, though, Pops. Oh, I see. Hang on. Ignore me. In case I get smacked by an invisible trailer. Yeah. The weirdest bit is Paul can hear me, like, taking it off and putting it back on. I can hear you, but, yeah. I can't see it either. AJ, hey, thank you for 14 months. I, I think Pops' trailer is in orbit right now. Whether the game What's will the accept him handing it in, I don't know. Right, frame. If you go out the way a minute, it's a fuel wire here. Yeah. Please. Trouble is, I can't help you with your trailer anymore because I can't see it. Yep. Thank you, friend. There you go. Yeah, it looks like he has a trailer, but I just can't see it. Paul, can you pull my truck? I'm stuck on a rock. I'm like, if I drive all this way being careful with a trailer that I can see and no one else can't and it doesn't work. I mean, yeah, we're potentially facing having to do all of that mission again, which was a brutal mission. Well, uh, it, it's... On, sorry. I mean, at the moment, as far as the world is concerned, just look on your map, Paul, and look at the AGS installation and see if you can see the trailer hovering in nowhere. And the only thing that I can suggest is that Pups jumps out of his truck and by hope, hope and hook and crook, but... No, it won't. It's gone, mm -hmm. I'm telling you. It, it happened to me. The only the only hope we have is that we get to the destination and, and the game so accepts the... Yeah, the game accepts the delivery. Because if it doesn't, we're doing the whole thing again. Well, that can wait till tomorrow if that gets the case, Paul. Oh, yeah. I mean, until that just happened, I was going to suggest you not stop in that kind of thing. So where is this supposedly floating trailer? 
Whoever's modding, I apologise on behalf of the game. Um, yeah. If you look on the map, Graham, if you zoom out as far as you can, you'll just see it hovering. Don't need to track that mission for that. Yeah, it's top secret is the mission. In around here is going to be fun, Paul. Wide flatbeds, I mean... Yeah, I can see at the side of the river. Is it up in the air though, right up from? Uh, no, it's on the ground. It's where it was when I when my game crashed, or when I when I got kicked out where we refueled. That's where it's on my on my screen. Okay, Sammy, I just got your screenshots. That's what construction it. rig semi trailer. Is that what we're hauling? Yes. Okay, so on my map, that's on the ground, just at the entrance to Erska River. Next to Frome. Like basically where you were, pups, when you went through yeah. the map. And on 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 Somies it's in mid air, and on Frome's it's down by the river. I I think we're gonna just cut our lot because basically if us where Paul thinks it is, then we're okay because it's on the main road. I think it happened, pups. Like you remember when I spawned in and my tattering yeah. went flying, and your trailer was up on a tree. I think yeah. that's when it got a bit weird. I'm gonna try something. While we're here, I'm going to jump into another truck and then jump back. Yeah, it's still on the truck for me. I don't know what to suggest. Like, if we park it here, but when it is where it is, it's not hard for us to get back. Yeah, it's just yeah, like... I'll, I'll be good with that and we'll deal with whatever mess it is in the morning. Yep. Stop yeah. Stop Oh my god, this game is a year in and it's still... Janky yeah. multiplayer. Unbelievable. Right, I've parked the seismic truck up. It's not. It's still a kilometer away from its destination, but it's in the right place. I want to know for science what happens when Paul jumps in my the truck that I was driving. Well, I'm quitting out to stop it being as janky as possible. Oh, while you guys are telling me what we're oh shoes. Um. All right. Anyway, let's uh, call it though, shall we? Yeah. Right. Thank you for watching, guys. Uh, we're going to continue this fast tomorrow. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Once our stress levels yeah. have subsided slightly. Um, yeah, we're back at 11 tomorrow. So um, hope to see you then. Thank you for your support. Thanks for hanging out and all that. Uh, Chris, you're not sure if you're going to be here. It's your birthday. Well, happy birthday, Chris. Well, I'm off now. Not sure if I'm going to be here as it's my birthday and I'm busy. So we'll see. Good night, all. Yeah. Guys, have a great uh, Saturday evening, and uh, we'll see you tomorrow. But good night from me, Pup, Sammy, and Rome. And uh, yeah. Good night. Good night. Take it easy, guys. Love you all. Good night.